Greetings friends and Robloxians, welcome to a little kingdom production. In today's video, I am going to be showing you portal designs that I started creating. This is not something that I came up with as an original idea, but each build is unique and it's my own take. I'm also going to showcase some friends, but here you see my pub portal and it is covered in this structure. I, I like to think of it as a, a design over the portal that doesn't hide the portal, but just makes it look like my own portal. I've used a bunch of slate bricks, uh, stairs, slabs. Now my portal is yellow, but when you put glass in front of it, and I've got purple glass, it lets you see right through it, and I really like that effect. And I've put some lanterns around it to kind of light it up, some torches, so it glows a little bit in the dark. Now the glass does cover it, so you can't go through that end, but then on the other side, after people have seen and visited the castle, that's the point of having them come over here, don't want them just spawn into my island and run right into the portal so it kind of serves a purpose to have this side blocked off. You can see there's the portal in there. They really want to get out, go through the portal to the hub, they go through this side. All right we're gonna take a look at mine and some friends as well but let's take a look at where I started building mine. I haven't finished them yet but I've started them and I used to have an industrial area down here I've converted it to a portals room. So, got my buffalo core portal here. It's kind of simple. It's like a room almost. But it's a, it's a threshold. It's a portal to the portal. Yeah, not super ornate on this one. I'm still undecided on the diamond mine portal. So this is the diamond mine portal. I'm probably going to be re reworking this a bit. I've already reworked it twice, but I, I don't have a specific idea in mind when I start designing and building these. I just kind of play with the blocks until something I like comes out. I've got two more portals to show you that are done here. Alright, so you may have seen the video of my Heaven's Elevator. I've got Heaven's Elevator right here. It's not a real portal, but really a gateway or a, another threshold that takes you to another area. So if you were to go down here, you actually reach the entrance to the Heaven's Elevator. So that takes you all the way up. But we're not going up there today. We're just going to be looking at the portals. I've got one last portal down here so you can guess what this one is the underworld <laughs> so this is just kind of thrown together covered everything in lava obsidian and some slate and regular brick just a mishmash got some red glass down there some lava dragon eggs while I continue to work on portals for the rest of my design, we'll take a look at some of my friend's portals. Before heading to look at friend's portal designs, I want to show you the new Little Kingdom merchandise, this Roblox Avatar clothing t-shirt item. It's only four Robux, and if you purchase one, I give you a huge shout out, a thank you, maybe gifts and prizes, so thank you for supporting this channel. We are at the Agents Island. This is one of the many corridors that they have but it leads to a very fun build to share with you <laughs> look at this they've got it's like a boiler or some kind of power plant right so you got caution tape on it <laughs> some tubes probably for exhaust and steam who knows it's all fiery but anyway that's not really what i want to show you this was about portals so in here they've got all their portals but you can read the signs, portal, teleport to ground level. So this is not a portal to another island. It's a doorway, right? But where is it going to go? Back to the spawn point. Oh, did you see that? That was cool. So they've got the spawn point right now in the building. Um, normally you would spawn 
if they weren't published, it'd spawn out here on the street. We'll have to do a tour of this island sometime. It is so amazing. But yeah, I wanted to show you guys that portal. Take one more look at it and do a slow-mo drop. is so fun this is <laughs> this place is so crazy i guess you're getting a mini tour right now amazing builders here the agents they call it the agency i visited this place when i had the little kingdom curse going on they assisted me all right so portal teleport to ground level That cool. <laughs> so fun. We <laughs> all right. Let's check out some more. This is Get Wrecked. I met them on Discord. I just was reaching out asking for anybody to share their fun portal designs, and Get Wrecked said that they would do it. So they kind of built this on the fly. I thought it was very creative. They definitely got a woodland feel to their island and they're continuing that theme with their threshold to the portal or a little portal house here. So they used ice and some wood, and mossy stone, some leaf blocks, got a candy cane flag up there. I like this a lot. Very creative. Thank you Get Wrecked for sharing your design. All right, we're at my friend Monkey Monkey's giving us the big reveal here. This is a very interesting build. So this looks like a portal that might go to the underworld, but it's it just looks like a portal right now. Great design. I love it. He could put a portal back there, but it looks like it's covered in glass. Very creative. Huge thank you to Monkey Monkey for taking part in building portal design. Love it. Thank you, Monkey Monkey. Now we're visiting again, my friend. Party Time, who's built this very nice little co covering around his pub portal. Uh, interesting ice design. I think it goes well with his snowmen. We looked at those in his video on the island's inspection. But he's also went ahead and made a platform over here, an area for each of his portals. These are nice. Um, this is more of that biome design. I think DV plays or uh, DV was taken did a video kind of similar to these designs where the portal sits out in an area that just kind of uh, resembles or elements of that area that it leads to. So I like these. These are nice. Very creative. Thank you to Party Time, aka DV Lonely Player. Here we are at my friend Rye Guy's Island. I. I think this might be one of his save slots. Uh, beautiful build here. Everything is wonderful about this place, but he volunteered to show the portal for my video. And wow, very creative, unique, and original. I've never seen a tree made out of pine planks before, but it looks great. It's like a mound with the roots all coming down. Beautiful pathway leading to the portal. Yeah, it is amazing. Artistic, creative, wonderful Rye Guy. Thank you so much for sharing this. Here we are back in the Little Kingdom to show you my finished builds. But stay tuned because I've saved the best for last. I really enjoy creative builds. I've said it many times that I steal most of my good ideas, but I thought of a new idea while making this video and talking to island-loving friends on Discord. Many of my friends, and some of you maybe, say you're bored with islands, that there's nothing to do, but also there's too much to do. It's very grindy and takes a long time to get anything. It would be very cool, in my opinion, if EZGG, the developers of islands, did an update where they removed a ton of unnecessary stuff and simplified the game. Along with that, take away the pre-made portals. Let us make our own portals. Imagine this. You get on your starter island for the very first time, you have your basic workbench, and you have a basic tutorial that tells you to mine your grass, your dirt, stone, and trees. And while doing that, you uncover a portal shard. In the tutorial, there's an animation that says, build a threshold and include the portal shard. 
That allows you access to the hub. And from there, you start doing quests that the NPC vendors give you in the hub. Anyway, I hope you've enjoyed looking at my portals. Now let's look at BTY and Cat's portal design. This is amazing. I don't know if it's Cat's or BTY's island, maybe a co-op, but it's beautiful. The purple glass pond, under the island they built down and it makes it look like the portal hill is reflecting in the water. The hill is covered in viney ivy, there's flowers and lanterns, it's all wonderful. Just can't get over it, it's so beautiful. Thank you so much for watching this video. Please hit that like and subscribe. Join the Little Kingdom Discord. A link to that is in this video's description. We would love to hear from you about your creative build ideas and maybe ideas for a future video. Really no limit to what you can do in Roblox Islands within 80,000 blocks. Again, thank you so much for watching. Remember to have fun and keep it imaginary. I think I'll try to take this portal home. Whee!